so hello everyone uh, today we see a new topic that is a volume strength of hydrogen peroxide so here volume strength uh, means it is nothing but indicates the concentration of hydrogen peroxide nothing but the type of hydrogen peroxide we know different methods for uh, uh, to express the concentrations that is molarity normality molality and uh, percentage composition percentage by weight by value different uh, methods are there to express the concentration but there is a uh, one separate method is that it is applicable only for hydrogen peroxide okay so there is a volume strength of hydrogen peroxide so it is totally based on its uh, decomposition reaction and the amount of oxygen released from it already we know the hydrogen peroxide uh, decomposes like this the hydrogen peroxide so decomposed so giving water and oxygen so here it is the very important that is a hydrogen peroxide is generally is a very unstable liquid it is stored in a separate arrangement it is stored in a separately arranged vessels uh, which are made up of glass oh, glass vessels this kind of glass vessels look at inside the glass vessels inside coated with the uh, wax a smooth very smooth surface would have some rough surface in the good up it easily decompose it to forming the h2 and oxygen yeah but the uh, they are stored in a perfect manner. Glass vessels which are coated inside with wax. Plus smooth surface to the cloth. Then store just them. But H2O2 on decomposition gives a H2O and oxygen. Okay. So here the important thing is uh, we compare the hydrogen peroxide and oxygen. So the concentration. The concentration of nothing but the purity the purity of hydrogen peroxide uh, so can be measured uh, with the help of the available oxygen so what is mean by available oxygen means uh, the volume of oxygen the volume of oxygen released uh, at stp by the decomposition of uh, one normality hydrogen peroxide so what is the uh, available oxygen means sir uh, the need to release a fraction of hydrogen peroxide decompose a h2o form it is o2 form it is h2o concentration general, general o2 is important one at the man of this kind of hydrogen peroxide sample decompose i oxygen releases so how much oxygen is released that basis ko ne h2o concentration ne jabtam so oxygen at releases na oxygen oxygen ne basis kum cheptanga but ee release in oxygen em antam ante that is called available oxygen this is called available oxygen of that hydrogen peroxide ante in terms of volume lo iskuntam oxygen okay ante man standard definition cheppalante volume strength concentration etla cheptam ante it is equal to the volume of oxygen it is equal to the volume of oxygen released by one normality of by one normality of hydrogen peroxide okay the one normality unna hydrogen peroxide solution nunchi enta oxygen release out at stp that is called volume strength and any hydrogen peroxide same oxygen is same it is not like that it is based on its strength that name one separate the volume strength antam కొన్ని శాంపిల్స్ ఆఫ్ హైడ్రోజన్ పెరాక్సైడ్ ఎక్కువ ఆక్సిజన్ ఇవ్వచ్చు కొన్ని శాంపిల్స్ ఆఫ్ హైడ్రోజన్ పెరాక్సైడ్ లెస్ ఆక్సిజన్ ఇవ్వచ్చు ఓకే అంటే హైడ్రోజన్ పెరాక్సైడ్ మన సేమ్ వన్ మోర్ వన్ నార్మల్ ఉన్న హైడ్రోజన్ పెరాక్సైడ్ అనే డిఫరెంట్ శాంపిల్స్ తీసుకున్నప్పుడు వన్ నార్మల్ ఉన్న హైడ్రోజన్ పెరాక్సైడ్ అనే డిఫరెంట్ శాంపిల్స్ తీసుకున్నప్పుడు దే ఆర్ నాట్ ప్రొడ్యూసింగ్ ఈక్వల్ వాల్యూమ్స్ ఆఫ్ హైడ్రోజన్ పెరా ఆక్సిజన్ దే ఆర్ నాట్ ప్రొడ్యూసింగ్ ఈక్వల్ వాల్యూమ్స్ ఆఫ్ ఆక్సిజన్ బికాస్ శాంపిల్ ప్యూరిటీలో డిఫరెన్స్ ఉంటుంది ఓకే సో ఆ ప్యూరిటీని మనం ఇక్కడ వాల్యూమ్ స్ట్రెంత్లో మె మెజర్ చేస్తున్నాం ఓకే సో వాల్యూమ్ స్ట్రెంత్ను ఎలా డిఫైన్ చేయొచ్చు అంటే యూ కెన్ రైట్ ద డెఫినేషన్ దట్ సో 
So the volume of oxygen so given by hydrogen peroxide given by one normal it is the condition given by one normal p hydrogen peroxide at stp is called is called volume strength of hydrogen peroxide so the formed oxygen is known as available oxygen okay this oxygen is generally known as available oxygen means in the volume strength uh, we are expressing the concentration of hydrogen peroxide in terms of available oxygen okay how to calculate the volume strength so here the two moles so i came to the balance the equation okay right there two moles of hydrogen peroxide gives only one mole of oxygen so one mole of oxygen so what is the volume we know that the condition is at stp stp conditions and the what is the one mole volume whatever it is the gas 22.4 liter so two moles of hydrogen peroxide releases how much oxygen one mole oxygen one mole oxygen means 22.4 liter so therefore we can write uh, two mole of hydrogen peroxide giving how much 22.4 liter of oxygen because at stp one mole equal 22.4 liter Okay, the two moles so two two point four liter and the what about one mole? So simple, one mole of hydrogen peroxide can release how much oxygen? Eleven point two liter of oxygen. Next, we have one mole of compound. If you are calculating for one liter, we can write one molarity. Okay, one molarity of hydrogen peroxide. One mole of hydrogen peroxide is releases eleven point two liter of oxygen. Here one mole, one mole of compound dissolve in that there is called one one molarity. Okay, in terms of liter this point. Okay, one molarity hydrogen peroxide. Actually, what I can do the volume strength definition. We have to take uh, one normality. That is the standard definition of it. One normality ki. एक तो ऑक्सीजन रिलीज हो ताकि फाइंड आउट चार्ज सो मोलारिटी की 11 वन मोलारिटी की 11.2 लीटर से तो व्हाट अबाउट वन नॉर्मलिटी सो वन नॉर्मलिटी हाइड्रोजन पेरोक्साइड रिलीजेस हाउ मच सो मोलारिटी नॉर्मलिटी वी नो द रिलेशन ओके सो वो हैव टू डिवाइड विद द एन फैक्टर सो एन फैक्टर के ना वैल्यूम स्ट्रे नो 5.6 वैल्यूम संडे दिगी वैल्यूम ने मन में मन नाम वैल्यूम संडे तो जस्ट रिवाइज़ डी डेफिनेशन डी वैल्यूम ऑफ ऑक्सीजन गिवन बाय वन नॉर्मलिटी हाइड्रोजन पेरोक्साइड सॉल्यूशन एट एसटीपी सर फिर वन नॉर्मलिटी हाइड्रोजन पेरोक्साइड एसटीपी देख रहे हैं तब लीज़ जस्ट अभी 
5.6 liter of oxygen. So, this basis is the final game reaction. We have one normality hydrogen peroxide is equal to 5.6 value strength. Okay, 5.6 value. Value strength is simple shortcut. The value strength. Value strength is also known as just values. 5.6 values of hydrogen peroxide. Just uh, remember it as a basic formula for hydrogen peroxide value strength. Now one normality of hydrogen peroxide solution on the measurement and value strength to then convert just 5.6 value strength and matter. Okay. So how you got this 5.6 values and that is the 5.6 values. 5.6 values of uh, uh, 1 liter this could take 1 liter calculate this number so 1 liter this could take 10 liters of hydrogen oxygen release out of the 5.6 liters of hydrogen release out sorry 5.6 liters of oxygen release out of it so try to understand clearly okay because it is very important topic okay So this uh, now we convert this uh, normality. This just remember it as a formula. And now we see one other method also for concentration in terms of uh, grams. So you can normality molar to compare this. Now we see square two moles of hydrogen peroxide again. The two moles, two moles. So in terms of mass is put the two moles means uh, 2 into 34. We know that okay. 68. So giving a so in compulsory values found out. It is no problem. So oxygen must be in uh, values. There is a uh, in terms of mass is put okay. And we are doing for one liter. So give it how much? 22.4 liter. 22.4 liter of oxygen. So 2 into 34 grams. So what about uh, we have to calculate it for 17 grams? Okay. So actually we now one molarity, one mole calculate jar. Okay, basic equation is two moles come in. One mole calculate jar. One mole calculate this day. We will get 11.2 liter. So, 1 mole under how many grams of the way? 1 mole okay. 34 grams per liter. 34 grams per liter gives how much? 11.2 liter of oxygen. So, my basic definition is the normality. So, normality and the one equivalent weight should all. We know that. Molarity and the 1 mole ki chase them. Normality and the 1 equivalent weight ki. Equivalent weight and again molecular weight by n factor so n factor hydrogen peroxide key we said that is 2 like now 34 grams equivalent weight key my name jelly molecular weight by n factor so 34 by 2 17 grams and normal to then the 17 grams convert instrument and normal to the convert chair gravity normal to come on one equivalent weight this one down one equivalent weight and the blue molecular weight by n factor so that is giving a 17 grams can to say so 5.6 liter of uh, oxygen so then you have to have nothing but uh, therefore 17 grams per liter 17 grams per liter is also called 5.6 values 5.6 values of uh, hydrogen peroxide so it can release it in the oxygen is easy so a release in oxygen the initial release in the hydrogen peroxide release in the gravity are the hydrogen peroxide sample release in a are the hydrogen peroxide sample in to release in the done even term 5.6 volumes type of hydrogen peroxide and then okay and in terms of normality this could have one normality 5.6 volumes of hydrogen peroxide is the standard one 
బట్ ఇది ఫర్ ద క్యాలిక్యులేషన్లో మనకు ప్రతిసారి నార్మల్స్లో ఇవ్వాలి మేబీ ఇట్ గివెన్ ఇన్ టర్మ్స్ ఆఫ్ మాస్ సో వీ విల్ గివ్ హ్యావ్ టు గెట్ ద రిలేషన్ ఆఫ్ మాస్ ఆల్సో సో మీకు ఈ టూ టర్మ్స్ కంపల్సరీ ఐడియా ఉండాలి ఓకే మీన్ దీస్ ఆర్ జస్ట్ లైక్ ఫార్ములాస్ ఓకే వన్ నార్మల్ కే ఆఫ్ హైడ్రోజన్ పెరాక్సైడ్ ఫైవ్ పాయింట్ సిక్స్ వాల్యూమ్స్ ఆఫ్ హైడ్రోజన్ పెరాక్సైడ్ ఇట్స్ ది సేమ్ వే సెమ్ సింపుల్ వన్ నార్మల్ మనం ఈక్వల్ అండ్ వెయిట్ తీసుకోవాలి ఈక్వల్ అండ్ వెయిట్ అయినప్పుడు మాలిక్యుల వెయిట్ బై ఎన్ ఫ్యాక్టర్ దట్ ఇస్ థర్టీ ఫోర్ బై టూ దట్ ఇస్ సెవెంటీన్ గ్రామ్స్ గీవ్స్ ఫైవ్ పాయింట్ సిక్స్ వాల్యూమ్స్ ఆఫ్ హెచ్ టూ టు ఎట్ ఎస్టీపి ఓకే so now we see a uh, one more relation so finally so on further calculation we can write for problems uh, in terms of percentage calculate this that is treated as 1.7 percentage we know that 17 grams of percentage equal 1.7 was told 1.7 percentage of hydrogen peroxide is equal to nothing but 17 grams per liter of hydrogen peroxide uh, nothing but equal to 1 normal to of hydrogen peroxide so these are all equal to 5.6 uh, volumes of hydrogen peroxide let's yes, we have to remember that this uh, total general relation check it out the pro 5.6 volumes so 5.6 volumes and how much oxygen 5.6 liter oxygen osthe mana em cheppinam danni 5.6 volumes annam okay even but any grams of oxygen release hote 5.6 volumes and 22.4 liters oxygen ki 32 grams hote so or but ki 5.6 volume just we will get 8 grams of oxygen okay so that is also equal to 8 gram of oxygen so this total relation is applicable only at std okay try to write the relation straightly okay so it is uh, at std just uh, write a statement that is uh, at std kara say okay so here one more important thing volume strength law so just to make a basic this could be 5.6 volumes ki okay so our problem lo eppudu 5.6 volume ga kuda different type of volumes isthadu aa different type of volumes ki manam normality or molarity so different volume strength percentage strength find out chali సో ఇక్కడ వాల్యూమ్ స్ట్రెంత్ అంటేనేమో ద వాల్యూమ్ ఆఫ్ ఆక్సిజన్ జస్ట్ స్ట్రెంగ్త్ అన్నప్పుడు గ్రామ్స్ పర్ లీటర్ గ్రామ్స్ పర్ లీటర్నే మనం స్ట్రెంగ్త్ ఆఫ్ ద సొల్యూషన్ అంటాం ఆల్ ఇన్ ద కాన్సన్ట్రేషన్ మెథడ్స్ వీడ్ ఎన్ ద ప్రాబ్లమ్స్ ఆన్ ఇట్ ఓకే గ్రామ్స్ పర్ లీటర్ క్యాల్కులేట్ చేయగలిగితే దట్ ఈస్ కాల్డ్ జస్ట్ స్ట్రెంగ్త్ ఆ పర్సంటేజ్ స్ట్రెంత్ వి నో దట్ నార్మల్ పర్సంటేజ్ క్యాల్కులేట్ చేస్తాం మొలారిటీ నార్మాలిటీ సో వాల్యూమ్ స్ట్రెంత్ అంటే అన్నిటికీ కామన్ ఏంటంటే వాల్యూమ్స్ సారీ మొలారిటీ నార్మాలిటీ పర్సంటేజ్ స్ట్రెంత్ అనేది అన్నిటికీ కామన్ అన్ని సొల్యూషన్స్కి బట్ వాల్యూమ్ స్ట్రెంగ్త్ ఇన్ టర్మ్స్ ఆఫ్ వాల్యూమ్స్ చెప్పడం అనేది ఏంటంటే దట్ ఈస్ ఓన్లీ ఫర్ హైడ్రోజన్ పెరాక్సైడ్ దట్ ఈ ట్రీటెడ్ యాజ్ ఇన్ టర్మ్స్ ఆఫ్ ఆక్సిజన్ దట్ ఈస్ బేస్డ్ ఆన్ ద డీకంపోజిషన్ ఆఫ్ హైడ్రోజన్ పెరాక్సైడ్ గివింగ్ హెచ్ టు వై ఆక్సిజన్ the form of oxygen is known as available oxygen means uh, the volume of uh, volume strength of hydrogen peroxide we are calculating we are measuring it in terms of available oxygen okay now we need some problems on it okay let's see the first one so calculate normality molarity strength in grams per liter and percentage strength of val pen volume strength of hydrogen peroxide ante manaki ichina hydrogen peroxide sample endante 10 volumes unna hydrogen peroxide okay so on the first we calculate the normality okay 
So we know the relation. What is the relation? 5.6 volumes equal. Volumes in the volume center. Now we are not talking about this volume. It is a 5.6 volumes of hydrogen peroxide. 5.6 volumes of hydrogen peroxide is equal. We know that this now we calculated as a formula. That is one normal P. So then what about uh, so 10 values? 10 values of hydrogen peroxide equal how much normal? How much normality? So approximately we will get uh, so 1.7 Okay, that is 1.785 normality Okay, next uh, calculate the molarity We know the relation between normality and molarity So molarity is equal to normality by n factor Therefore, 1.785. What is the n factor for hydrogen peroxide? 2 because it can release 2 H plus ions. Okay. So we will get 0 0.8. Okay. Zero point eight nine molarity. Okay. So already we said 5.6 volumes basic formula of this. Puna. Same with them, 10 volumes. Puna. Uh, we have to remember this because the 5.6 so compared is a 10 volumes of a basic perfect value of the country. So 10 volumes key molar normality 1.785. So 10 volumes key 0.89 normality. Sorry, molarity. Now we calculate the strength. And we know that uh, 5.6 volume strength, 5.6 volume strength hydrogen peroxide is equal to how many grams? So we know that one normal that a one equivalent weight, the 17 grams per liter. Simple. What about 10 volume strength of hydrogen peroxide is how many grams per liter? So we will get uh, 30, yes, 30.35 grams, grams per liter. Okay, this is one basic value. So it is a problem and it will be treated as a uh, formula also. The next, uh, strength in percentage strength fiber channel. So we know that uh, the formula 5.6 volume strength hydrogen peroxide is equal to 1.7 percentage. Okay, 1.7 percentage. Simple. What about for 10 values? Okay. 10 volume strength of hydrogen peroxide is equal to how much percentage? Here we get approximately three point something. Okay, approximately three. We can write three point zero three percentage. But generally, it is taken as the three. Three point zero three general one. Three ka process to formula sir. Means uh, so ten values separate problem in the chapter man type because if we just manam ten values ki uh, we have to remember them as a formula. So ten values ki ten values of hydrogen peroxide type. In terms of uh, strength, that is 30, 30.35 grams per liter. Are there 10 volumes of hydrogen peroxide? Ke, what is the percentage strength? The percentage strength that is a uh, 3 percentage. Okay, 3 percentage. Next, uh, what is the normality? 1.785 normality. 10 volumes, 1.785 normality. What is the molarity? Zero, one, 10 volumes, 0 0.89 molarity. It is a totally fixed one. Okay. So here we can uh, write an important point. 
So with the help of this problem, let's write a fixture. There is a ten valium hydrogen peroxides. Ten valiums hydrogen peroxide is equal to what is the normality? 1.785 normality hydrogen peroxide. And it is also equal to 0.89 molarity. It is also equal to grams. There is a 30.35. This we are taking as a 30. Okay. 30. Okay. Write the total value. But in the calculations we can take as a 30. In terms of grams per liter. Or it is also 3 percentage. So this is important one. So actually um, one more basic thing is one of the problems are 100 values and listed. So actually just we calculate 100 values. So next problem is 100 values only. So no, no need to calculate the separately again. So then we 100 values to calculate it. If 100 value of not value it is values. Values means value strength. Okay. 100 values hydrogen peroxide is equal how much? Simply 17.85 normality. 8.9 molarity. Okay. Next, how many grams? 303.5 grams per liter. What is the percentage? 30 percent is very important. So, my maximum strength is very rare cases. So, maximum molarity and normality is 30 percent value very important. And 30 percent, 30 percent hydrogen peroxide percentage strength is equal to 100 values of hydrogen peroxide. Okay. So, so important problem on this uh, is calculate the number of moles, calculate the number of moles and weight of oxygen produced on heating 1.12 liter of 10 volumes of hydrogen peroxide. So, you can just uh, 10 volumes, 10 volumes and up to, we know that uh, that indicates about the Type of hydrogen peroxide. So, when you 10 volumes of hydrogen peroxide, when you 5.6 volumes, when you 100 volumes of hydrogen peroxide, even in that hydrogen peroxide different samples. Okay? And the only hydrogen peroxide is based on the purity. And the purity is the same model. Okay? But only we know the 10 volumes of hydrogen peroxide and the entire leach is the 10 volumes of 1 liter. Only we just calculated it. So that looks one one liter this quantity ten liters of oxygen of study. It releases ten liters of oxygen. And the ten volumes are now. So ten volumes of hydrogen peroxide are ten volumes of hydrogen peroxide sample. Okay. So just different samples are there. So so for example, you look at hydrogen peroxide. So it must be closed perfectly. So if the eight and eight sample take ten volume of hydrogen peroxide. It is a 10 volume hydrogen peroxide. So 10 volume hydrogen peroxide. It is the sample this one. It is the amount this one. 1.12 liter this one. It is a volume indicate this is not exact volume. It is volume strength. The 10 volumes of hydrogen peroxide meaning in that. This sample is one liter this. Then in the 10 volume hydrogen peroxide. Now because it is able to release 10 liters of because it is able to release 10 liters of oxygen with 1 liter. At this sample, this bottle launch 1 liter. 1 liter hydrogen peroxide is going to reaction chest. 10 liters of oxygen. At the 100 volume strength of type of hydrogen peroxide. At the sample launch 1 liter, 100 liters of oxygen release out. Here are 10 volumes of hydrogen peroxide. At the sample launch 1 liter, this is going to decompose chest. 10 liters of hydrogen peroxide of cell. That is the entry is going to get a 1.12 liter this code. So, then we have simple two methods for this now. First, we write the general method. So, based on our definition model. 
So what is the mean of a ten volumes hydrogen peroxide uh, being given at the pay one liter of hydrogen peroxide sample. E e in the launch one liter of hydrogen peroxide produce uh, how much? Ten liter of oxygen. That is original value. So, the entry is going to be one point one two liter. This one is sample only. So, can produce how much oxygen? So, one point one two liter. <coughs> so, total how much? Eleven point. Uh, it releases eleven point two liters of oxygen. So this name came from what you have to give this this name. Ah, we write it as a so precious chapter. I could not. We are able to write it a formula model. So in this case, because how much volume of oxygen really is it? So twelve thousand six hundred questions. Come on, take volume of O two. Value of oxygen released. So increase the value of oxygen released. But in my case, is actually my case. There is one point one two liter. Oh, one point one two liter. Is the value of hydrogen peroxide. Value of hydrogen peroxide into what is the ten? I mean, ten is my case. Ten liter. Sorry, ten ten values. Volume strength of hydrogen peroxide. So, if you know by one liter comparison of one liter, we calculate this to get the separate the mention that is also known. Okay. Actually, what is the original? What is the original meaning? You have to remember. Okay. But hundred volumes of hydrogen peroxide the meaning is that. Okay. A hundred volumes of hydrogen peroxide sample launch to one liter this quantity. That is hundred liter oxygen also. इक टेन वैल्यूम हाइड्रोजन पेर आक्सइड का दीं वन लीटर दूसरे टेन लीटर वस्तु प्रसाई टोटल क्यार्ट दी मैं फार्मला मोडिफा इट इस वाल्यूम आफ आक्सीजन रिज इज ईक्वल वाल्यूम आफ हाइड्रोजन पेर आक्सइड टेक इन टू वाल्यूम स्ट्रेन सिंपल नैक्स्ट द प्रॉब्लम इट इज आलो गिवेन इट क्युलेट द नंबर आफ मोल ओके नंबर आफ मोल सेवन पाइं टू लीटर्स So the number of uh, moles of oxygen, number of moles of oxygen, liters long, eleven point two liters. Number of weight in terms of weight, I think what is the formula for number of moles? Weight by gram molecular weight. Are in terms of weight is there? Are they meaning that in terms of liters is there? So the volume by molar value. Okay, mass by molar mass. Volume is there. Volume by molar value. So molar value, but a fix there is a twenty two point four liter. So that is a zero point five moles. But there is some problems are also there. Tomorrow we see the problems. But try to uh, read two three times to this topic. Okay.